Light bulbs are not the largest component of an individual's personal energy use, but they have undergone a great many changes in the last three decades. If you're buying a new light bulb or want to reduce your personal energy use for lighting, what should you do? Let's compare the energy use of some different types of light bulbs. Here's an old-fashioned incandescent light bulb. It uses 60 watts, and it lasts for perhaps a thousand hours. You turn it on, it comes to full brightness immediately, you can dim it, and it doesn't hum or flicker. If you leave this bulb on for 24 hours per day for 365 days per year, it will use 60 watts times 24 hours per day times 365 days per year equals 525,600 watt hours per year. Divided by 1,000 watts per kilowatt equals 526 kilowatt hours per year. Here's a compact fluorescent light or CFL bulb that gives off an equivalent light output. It uses 14 watts and will last for approximately 10,000 hours. However, it does not come up to full brightness immediately, and it takes even longer to come up to full brightness in colder temperatures. It gives off an audible hum, and most importantly, it requires mercury in the manufacturing process. And if the bulb breaks or is not recycled, some of that mercury will be released to the atmosphere, contributing to an increase in the global cycling of mercury. It uses 14 watts. If you leave this bulb on for 24 hours per day for 365 days per year, it will use 14 watts times 24 hours per day times 365 days per year equals 122,640 watt hours per year. Divided by 1,000 watts per kilowatt equals 123 kilowatt hours per year. That's roughly one quarter of the electricity of the incandescent bulb. Here's a light emitting diode or LED bulb of equivalent light output. It uses 10 watts and will last for approximately 25,000 hours. It does come up to full brightness immediately in any temperature. It does not hum and is fully dimmable. It does not contain any mercury, so the environmental implications of improper disposal are minimal. However, LED bulbs contain semiconductor electronics that probably do result in more generation of toxic waste during the production process, and if not disposed of properly, there is the potential for trace metals to be released to the environment. And at present, LED bulbs are five times more costly than CFLs. However, prices are dropping. It uses 10 watts. If you leave this bulb on for 24 hours per day for 365 days per year, it will use 10 watts times 24 hours per day times 365 days per year equals 87,600 watt hours per year divided by 1,000 watts per kilowatt equals 88 kilowatt hours per year. That's one-sixth of the electricity of the incandescent bulb and one-half of the electricity of the compact fluorescent bulb. Changing your light bulb is not going to solve our global climate challenges, but it is something that can be done fairly easily and it pays for itself over time. Furthermore, you do it once and the savings begin to accumulate immediately and they don't require a further change in behavior. When attempting to reduce our personal energy use, we always want to conserve first. So turning off lights when not needed is always the first step. However, switching to bulbs that emit the same amount of light and use less electricity is an excellent way to increase your lighting efficiency.